Who are you? What are you doing? Get out of here! Mom! <laughs> Lou? Lou? You okay? <laughs> okay, honey. Calm down. It's all right. We're just having another bad dream. I can't breathe. Yes, you can. You're fine. Just relax. Just take slow, deep breaths, nice and easy. There's nothing to be afraid of. I'm trying, but I can't. Relax. Slow, deep breaths. I... Yeah. Lou? Oh my god. Lou? Lou, wake up! Wake up, Lou! Come on! Lou! Do you believe a spirit could be hurting your son? No, of course not. Because if he's been taught to believe that, it is possible for the fear alone to affect heart function. I'm an engineer. I know illnesses aren't caused by evil spirits. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I just had to check. Anything else you need to check? Nope. You smell that? Yeah. It smells like wet dog. Holy crap. You're telling us some random person broke into your house to dismember a pig in your son's bedroom? A pig? My father-in-law. What did you do? What you should have done weeks ago when the dream started. I'm saving you. The reason Grandpa thinks the kid's soul is stolen is because he's convinced his son, the kid's father, had his stolen as well. He beat his boss to death. No, get away. Look, this needle isn't nearly as big as the one in your arm, and that didn't hurt, did it? I don't want it. They need to do it, Lou. You'll only feel a little pinch as we give you the numbing medicine. After that, you won't feel a thing. No! Lou, calm down. It's gonna be okay. What's he saying? What's the problem? I don't know. He's saying it's too late. There's nothing we can do. It's Mong. He doesn't speak Mong. He's never even heard it. It isn't him speaking. It's the Da. He's seizing. Oh, oh my god. Need some lorazepam in here? Seizure rules out Hashimoto's. Yeah, that's the issue. Not that we have no rational explanation for how the patient spoke a language he's never even heard. I've got one. Dang ton li doi. It means you're a bunch of pathetic idiots at Mong. Or it doesn't. But you wouldn't know because none of you speak Mong. Kid, on the other hand, is presumably fluent in gibberish. The grandfather speaks Hmong. He translated. He heard what he wanted to hear. Doctors say my brain is sick. Your doctors are trying their best, but they're not looking in the right place. You know, I know this is a lot to put on an eight-year-old, but you have angered our ancestors by ignoring them. Now, do you remember how to talk to them? Yeah, that's right. Good. Now, close your eyes, and we will ask for forgiveness together. You're doing good. But we have to do more. The evil spirits are in the air, and the only way to stop them is by stopping the air. You have to be brave. I'm not trying to hurt you. This will help you. I know it will. Lou? Are you okay? I can't wake him up. Lou? Lou? You're safe. You're in the hospital. Get Grandpa away! He's not here, honey. It was just a dream. He was choking me! No, Lou. It wasn't real. It was. He grabbed my neck. Those bruises weren't there before. Da. 
Doctors? God. Was he? Yes. My father-in-law. He thinks the calling ceremony didn't work because Lou wasn't there. And you think he's right? I don't know. I'm sorry, but there's no way we can allow him to perform an exorcism in your son's hospital room. Then I will have to take him home. A day ago, you were insulted. I didn't even think you might believe that stuff. And now you're willing to stop all treatment so you can try it? Maybe Zhang was right about Cao. The man I loved wasn't evil and would never do what he did. He was possessed. And my son needs his soul back. He's still barely breathing. Lou, how you feeling? Any stronger? Lou, can you hear me? What's wrong? I'm not sure. Lou, I need you to squeeze my hand. He's not responding. Get me an amp of D50. You're wrong again? I'm calling his grandfather. What about Kawasaki? Explains the irregular heartbeat, respiratory distress, and seizures. It fits. Which means he needs a coronary bypass. Can't be Kawasaki. Echo would have shown it. But a patent ductus arteriosus... It can't be a PDA. He's not an infant, nor has he had any symptoms for eight years. Maybe he has. He had an infected ductus, which we inadvertently treated with antibiotics. So no evidence is evidence of evidence? I'm just saying, it's consistent. It's a billion to one. Which means there are seven people in the world who fit the diagnosis. I thought we were looking for a hundred. Well, maybe PDA is more common than we thought. But idiot doctors like you... You're wrong. But the treatment's just ibuprofen. Closes a malformed duct. Worst case scenario, he just doesn't get better. No, worst case scenario is, you piss me off. You're not gonna let us save an eight-year-old because one more person might embrace religion? Does anyone here think my diagnosis is right? Well then, I have decided for today only to respect your opinions. We will proceed according to your diagnosis and nothing else. We need to put him on the OR schedule. His BP's dropping. He's crashing. Call a code. You need to stop this. I'm giving him the ibuprofen. didn't. Mrs. Chang, the medicine I administered was a long shot treatment for Lou's heart, but that's what's helping him. Ibuprofen? That's for headaches. I know it seems hard to believe, but it's true. And I know this seems hard for you to believe. Honey, Grandpa was right. He saved you. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>